uh, Python programming language. It was uh, actually opened in Python. And that was the problem because uh, uh, some supporting uh, files or modules uh, which will help the system to uh, calculate uh, or compute some uh, or, or implement some uh, statements are not uh, available uh, with uh, Python but it is available uh, in SageMath. Uh, uh, I mean uh, so many uh, yeah, supporting uh, files supporting uh, modules are available with uh, SageMath. So, uh, so when we implement uh, those uh, those steps in SageMath, uh, uh, it can work. But now, so for that, uh, uh, what we uh, what we uh, need to do is uh, we have to open the project uh, in SageMath. You can see that, uh, and this particular project is opened in SageMath. Uh, but you can, I, I can, uh, I can show you uh, the previous one. Uh, that project was not opened in uh, SageMath. For that, uh, see, uh, you can see that uh, here are uh, two projects uh, are there. Uh, this, uh, this was, uh, this is the uh, the previous one. Uh, last time I worked uh, and I can uh, show uh, I can open that when it is open you can see uh, that uh, it is not uh, yeah you can see that it is uh, uh, yeah, it, uh, it's actually created with the uh, Python it's open in uh, Python 3 uh, so uh, you can uh, see that symbol here so that's why this error uh, message we got uh, because uh, entire modules are not there associated with the uh, Python uh, now uh, we again I want to go back to uh, that uh, second uh, uh, second project so if you want to uh, get the output or if you want to uh, implement all uh, steps in um, the uh, uh, steps in the programming so uh, what you uh, require uh, you require that uh, uh, you require a project which is open in uh, SageMath so uh, try to open a project in SageMath that's important Yeah, this is uh, notebook two. I will open. Yeah, it's in Sage Math. And so, uh, coming back to um, our uh, steps of programs. See, so we'll continue the demonstration. Uh, the system is uh, very slow because too many programs are open in it yeah now uh, you can see that uh, this one uh, yeah when when you type a pi you will get it uh, uh, you will get that uh, output uh, displayed uh, see from that beginning uh, let's see uh, let's check it uh, from the beginning okay now uh, yeah uh, okay, uh, it doesn't show anything, but uh, let's see. Here. But any anyway, it doesn't show any. Uh, yeah, it's 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 showing that that output uh, is showing pi. Uh, okay, so uh, the system has accepted that. Uh, then uh, next uh, next command is uh, uh, yeah to display approximately the uh, values of uh, the value of uh, pi. Uh, uh, um, yeah, um, yeah, taking three decimal places or uh, sub, uh, yeah, corrected to three decimal places we want to display the content of uh, pi mm, okay for that I copy and uh, paste it in uh, next uh, input uh, uh, input uh, line and then um, I uh, run it uh, you can see you can so so no error but uh, uh, it it shows three point one four two 
yeah the output uh, correct 3.142 you can see next uh, uh, i i uh, am going to uh, increase uh, and the accuracy of the value displayed by uh, slightly adjusting uh, that uh, number of digits uh, uh, which uh, um, in which uh, uh, number of digits used to display that uh, uh, that the number pi uh, it is now increased to 20 and you can see that uh, uh, result uh, you can see the uh, you can uh, yeah you can see the uh, result here <coughs> yeah, that result is 3.14 <coughs> One three uh, one uh, one four one five etc. Yeah, yeah, it's correctly uh, coming uh, now. See uh, this expression uh, when we uh, type this expression. This is uh, a six raised to five raised to two. Uh, 6 to the power of 5 to the power of 2 um, can be displayed uh, can be its value can be displayed just by typing that uh, uh, there in uh, uh, in the in the input uh, and, uh, and you get that output uh, a very big number you can get that output here mm, output 4 next you know uh, the same thing you can uh, uh, you can assign to a variable see how uh, yeah suppose y is the variable and uh, i uh, put equal and then same uh, same quantity i copy and then uh, if you want to uh, display that uh, uh, value uh, you just type y the variable uh, name and uh, then uh, enter uh, type enter you get oh what is the problem yeah it is plus uh, uh, yeah it, there's some there's an error uh, in my typing so um, yeah I will correct it so, so y equal to y equal to must be there and then uh, 6 uh, uh, instead of uh, y equal to what I did uh, I typed uh, plus um, that's the problem and then uh, I I I uh, I use y and, uh, to display that value. So you can see that uh, uh, content. It's a different way by assigning uh, that uh, number to a variable, and then uh, we call the value of that variable. And this is uh, this is a little uh, bit. Uh, a uh, lengthy step uh, you can say that it is not it's a little bit tougher than uh, that simple step of uh, director displaying that value okay next uh, uh, what is there uh, to be discussed okay okay uh, you, we, are, uh, we are going to see uh, the output of uh, uh, this uh, statement factorial 5 factorial 5 when uh, it is uh, it's typed there uh okay yeah i type factorial 5 and then uh then then i want to yeah to show the uh, value uh, yeah you can see that it is 120 uh, factorial 5 is equal to 120 this displayed and uh, suppose we uh yeah we want uh, yeah we suppose we want uh, a much bigger factorial uh see factorial of 10 factor of 10 suppose you want then uh, what you can do uh, you have to replace 5 by 10 uh, to obtain the factorial of 5 so it acts as a function factorial is a function it's an inbuilt function uh, which is uh, coming along with the python actually you know python is the programming language that is uh, uh, working behind uh, sagemath sagemath is a is a comprehensive uh, yeah it is a, uh, it's it's a combined uh, uh, modules and uh, yeah, f uh, basically python is there to support uh, Sagemath uh, to, to support the facilities of language uh, programming language uh, Python is there and but uh, in addition to that uh, programming language you know for uh, uh, for running uh, some uh, 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 so some specific uh, activities some specific uh, 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 program modules you can say that or uh, to do some functions uh, for example uh, yeah, factorial there are many uh, 
mathematical um, uh, functions, sine, cos, uh, etc. There are a lot of mathematical functions are there, and uh, some uh, statistical functions are there, simple uh, arithmetical uh, functions are there. So this kind of uh, operations, uh, um, operations and functions uh, uh, should be uh, performed. But for, uh, it is not easy to uh, sub write separately uh, the Python code for uh, each of such uh, programs. So. Mm, uh, yeah, programmers uh, have developed uh, uh, separate modules for uh, uh, for doing all those uh, 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 all, all those uh, programs or so all, all those activities uh, which uh, they actually uh, intend to uh, yeah, perform uh, perform they then uh, include all those in uh, some specific modules and uh, uh, then after that they uh, put separate names for those modules and uh, then they uh, attach it with uh, uh, that uh, SageMath system. So uh, in this way, SageMath is uh, uh, has uh, has become uh, very bigger and bigger uh, um, developed uh, programming platform. Uh, which is working with the support of uh, uh, the basic uh, language uh, uh, Python. Now, all those supporting modules are written in uh, uh, Python itself. And uh, for, uh, some other examples are also possible, uh, can, can be given. Uh, for uh, another one is uh, for, um, you know, for uh, drawing uh, purpose, for, uh, um, for drawing charts and uh, figures. Um, uh, or for uh, uh, including graphic environments, you know, uh, separate modules are required, and uh, uh, some other uh, type of uh, specialized uh, advanced computing um, uh, specific uh, uh, modules are required. So uh, all those kind of modules are uh, separately built, uh, and uh, they are uh, finally then attached to the SageMath system. And that's why that's how this uh, SageMath uh, system is. Uh, built or developed okay so that's some um, uh, general concept about uh, uh, sage math so uh, if you try to uh, implement uh, some uh, programs or steps uh, some some uh, programming steps uh, in uh, Python um, then you may not uh, uh, get the required output it will show error message because uh, uh, the specific uh, steps or uh, specific supporting uh, modules for implementing that particular uh, type of activity may not be available with the uh, Python but it will be available with the uh, SageMath so uh, you need to open the project in SageMath to uh, uh, do the uh, do all types of uh, uh, calculations. Yeah, now uh, let's see the output of uh, uh, output of this uh, step. Okay, you are going. You can see that uh, this is the number thirty six uh, uh, twenty uh, twenty eight uh, and eight hundred is the number. Okay, as you give uh, very big number inside it, uh, much uh, 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 much much big number. Uh, if you give it, uh, and then you can see it will take a long time. So, for example, uh, just type uh, uh, just for a demonstration. Just type uh, twenty. Okay, twenty. Instead of ten, uh, if I type twenty, and then. You can see, ah, it's uh, f faster. Yeah, it 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 works fast, and we, we got that uh, um, answer easily. But instead, if you use uh, 50 or 100, you then uh, you can you have to wait uh, some time uh, to obtain that uh, output because computation takes a longer time. Okay. Now uh, let's see uh, the computation of expressions. Uh, okay, and we are going to uh, demonstrate this. Uh, and first, uh, we uh, first we assign three to the variable i z, and then we will calculate an expression. Um, an expression phi plus z cube uh, will be calculated. Like, uh, okay, so first uh, it is assigned z is equal to three. And then uh, we define, uh, and then then uh, then we define is that the uh, okay that expression is uh, five plus is that cube? But you know, for five plus is that cube, uh, you need to uh, okay, right? Five plus 
z he said you know to obtain cube uh, you uh, uh, i think it is better uh, using a double star uh, for uh, for obtaining uh, the effect of uh, exponentiation uh, because cap uh, yeah, it is suggested in the text but i think uh, when you use that uh, it may uh, create some problem it may not work properly but that can also that you can uh, you, uh, you can uh, try it using uh, that cap but i am uh, now i am uh, going to use uh, double star for uh, getting exponentiation double star of 3 double star 3 and uh, okay then uh, we uh, execute it uh, to obtain that number 32 as its answer uh, yeah it is there uh, that answer is 32 okay now I, I am going to uh, show a slightly uh, different way the same thing uh, no, already now z is equal to 3 it is assigned okay and then uh, I am going to define a function now uh, f of uh, z is equal to uh, f of z f of z uh, equal to f of z equal to the same thing Okay, copy f of z equal to okay, and then uh, so I have assigned uh, that expression to the function. A function f of z is defined, and then uh, it is uh, this expression, the same expression is assigned to it. And then uh, if I uh, take the value f of z now, uh, you can see what's going to uh, get. No, uh, because automatically uh, is equal to 3 will be assigned to uh, that expression uh, it will be taken to uh, uh, taken into the expression and it will calculate that uh, value and you can uh, see uh, uh, the displayed answer oh sorry uh, it's uh, showing only that uh, expression uh, it's, it's showing only that expression no, it is not taking uh, but you know for assigning value to inside that expression and there exists a separate command and we have to use that command now it, it doesn't take uh, as uh, automatically that value is not taken into that means z equal to 3 is not taken into but you can see that uh, if, if, if we define uh, f z in this way and uh, if you uh, type again f z or if you are asking uh, if the value of f is as output it will uh, simply show the uh, expression the same expression as its output not uh, the value not the same value it is now x cube 3 but you can here you can see that it, a cap is used to uh, express and uh, that exponentiation he said cube 3 plus 5 you can see so uh, you can try that also let's see uh, whether it will uh, be accepted Mm, whether it will be accepted and see that um, okay then now again I, I calculate it uh, let's see uh, no uh, yeah it's uh, yeah it's accepted no problem uh, cap can also be used yeah if instead of a double star uh, you can use cap also uh, no error is uh, now shown okay and the system will accept that also no problem okay now uh, coming to that uh, uh, now the, the the next discussion and that is assignment how to assign uh, uh, yeah, sorry uh, comparison this is after completing that uh, discussion on assignment we have completed it now we are uh, we have uh, come to uh, that uh, uh, the comparison expression you know compile for comparison we use a uh, uh, double uh, uh, double equal to symbol or uh, equal to symbol two times we can uh, we can use for comparison and uh, so uh, let's uh, try let's try this uh, first we mm, first we uh, uh, write this x equal to uh, two uh, x equal to two is uh, written then and then uh, what we can do then x uh, uh, you, if, you, if you write uh, now, now x equal to means uh, 2 is assigned to the uh, location of uh, x and uh, now if you uh, type uh, double 2 uh, sorry double equal to and then uh, uh, if you take the output Yeah, you can see the value two. It is true. Yes, you now you are asking uh, by 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 typing x uh, e double equal to two. You are asking a question to the system uh, whether this statement is true. 
whether x equal to is true yeah that uh, uh, um, according to the existing value of x uh, uh, the value uh, is now the, the comparison uh, is true is correct so we get the answer uh, true instead if we type uh, x uh, x uh, double equal to 3 and you check the output uh, then you can uh, see that it is false because uh, existing what is the existing value of uh, x uh, uh, according to that uh, uh, the step x equal to this step according to this step the existing value of x is equal to so if you ask whether x is equal to 3 uh, you get the answer uh, false now using uh, using a solve uh, solve a command well, the solve command, uh, um, the use of solve command is the um, uh, is the topic of our next discussion, next next demonstration. Uh, you know, uh, I have explained uh, that explained that solve can command can be used to solve uh, uh, either a single uh, either a single expression, single equation, or double equa two equations, or more than uh, two equations. Uh, in general, uh, m equations and n unknowns and unknowns can be solved using the solve. Uh, uh, command so it's very powerful the command is uh, the solve command is very powerful uh, we are going to see that uh, strength of that uh, solve command now you can see it uh, by uh, simply copying it okay we copy it in that uh, in, the, in the next input uh, uh, okay input uh, line and then uh, uh, take the output here okay it's uh, showing uh, error what is the problem uh, some error is uh, displayed we have to check it uh, check the problem with uh, the command Okay. Okay, then yeah, it says that uh, uh, it is not a valid variable. Um, uh, X which one is not a valid variable 2 is not a where is 2 um, plus 2 2 is not a valid variable ok we have to check it again uh, so Okay, uh, we will uh, do that. Uh, mm, we will fix that, and then uh, we'll again um, yeah, uh, come back. Okay, after fixing that, we'll come back. Okay, thank you.